Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Mekdalawit and today's video is all about damaged souls. Do damaged souls still have worth? Well, if you want to know the answer, make sure to watch the video till the end. My name is Nathalie Johannes Appen. I'm 21. I've been living on the streets for about four months at the young age of eight. I became homeless because um, I decided to, to live on the streets because it was actually better for me. Uh, because as a child, I was getting beaten up. I was getting beaten severely and constantly. And, uh, I was scared to leave with my parents. Kids become homeless when they are treated roughly by their own parents. They're taking a lot of damage and anger. And they do not want to go back at home. I ate some kind of wood. I don't, I don't quite remember what it was. But I got sick. It was at night. I was in so much pain I couldn't even move. Um, I had diarrhea on my pants. I spent the rest of the night with that. The next day, people were passing by. Some of them were giving me money. Some of them were staring at me while, while, while they were passing. By. And this guy came. The hardest thing about being homeless is being alone, despite the hunger, despite the thirst. This guy grabbed his down and threw it at me in the sleep. Bam! Some people judge you with what you wear. But what you wear is not who you are. I mean, a lot of people judge kids standing on the streets. Thieves. Kids that live on the streets never chose to be in this position. And they do not want to stay. They do not want to bake. They just want to survive. They have nobody. They have nothing. They bake because they want to eat. They steal because they are hungry. When I was in the streets, I stole. When I was in the streets, I begged. When I was in the streets, I always wanted to get out of that life and to have a normal life like any other kid. So my biggest fear was that I would live the rest of my life in the streets. Family means home to me. Person that is willing to help means home to me. 
matter how low you go or how lost you feel, there always is tomorrow. And tomorrow may just be the day that you get lifted up and find your way. There's just one thing that tomorrow demands of you to make this happen. That you never stop believing in yourself to create a better day. You, you still have worth. Hey, thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe to this channel so you don't miss a single video. And don't forget to share this with a friend. Thanks again for watching.